Fine. I'll put Alyssa in her bed for a minute and I'll come with you. You must have got some bag in the hospital after all. So cringy. Okay. I'm coming. Jeez, these people. Oh. It's you. Again. Go away. Go away. Hello. Oh my god. Is this flight number eight? My name is Rita Tickle from the Happy Nanny Agency. Y you were just May here in, and please? you just said that and I said go away. I've told you already. You're too late. You have? I thought I got the wrong door last time. Oh my god, it's are you right stupid? Door. I was looking for a nanny, but I'm not anymore. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. You were looking for a nanny. I have 10 years experience and training in child discipline techniques and behavioural psychology. Also, I am known for good personal hygiene, strong work ethics, and I only take one break every five hours. Just to use the restroom. Leave. Wow, that sounds really great. Oh my god. But I'd god. like you to go away now. You don't need a nanny. No. Nope. I've decided to give my baby up for adoption. <laughs> You're Bye. An evil person. Bye. You'll go to hell for doing that to your baby. Oh my god. Yeah. I've already been to hell. They don't want me there. What do they want me to do now? Can I cut the wires with these scissors? I don't know if that's safe. Yeah. How are you doing what? I didn't want to do that. I want to use the scissors for something. I just... What am I meant to do? Oh, wait. Because now the power's off. These scissors seem sharp enough. Yes, just do it. Just do Let's it. Let's create some diversion. I hope this is what Mitzi had in mind. to the lights. I'm... I'm terrified of the dark. I... I... I, I can't move. Oh god. I can't breathe. Calm down. It's alright. Probably just that stupid meter. It must have run out of money again. It's not even that dark. Please, you've got to do something about it. I... Th I think I'm going to faint. 
fine to stay in my bedroom. There'll still be plenty of sunlight there at this time of the day. I'll go outside and put some money on the meter. It'll only take a minute. Oh, it's now controlling Mitsu, okay. Aha. Right. Let's do it. Do it then. No. Oh. Was that you, Mrs. Ashworth? What happened? Um, no idea. Maybe it's a blackout, like in the old days. It's probably just the meter. Let me see. Yeah, well, it seemed pretty obvious to me, but... This interview is over. I don't get it. The cable's been cut. But why would anyone do that? I think we're going to go now. This whole... Pa is that you, Mitzi? We haven't finished yet. Have you changed your mind about the job? No, of course not. I'm just scared of darkness. And I still feel sick, you know. Perhaps we can continue some other time. Who is that? I've had it. I'm getting a new fuse box. Was that you, Jesse? Yeah. How are you doing, Pauline? Well, I we need the power back. Who is that that can woman back again? Yeah, I can easily fix that. There's an electrical store that's open till late. I'll get some stuff, and I'll be back before you know it. Bear in mind it's not just the fuse box, it's the cable this time. I'll get a new cable too, don't worry. But in the meantime, go home, find some candles and chill, yeah? Thanks, Jesse. That's awfully nice of you. Well, it was great seeing you, but we're going to leave now. Hello? Who's that? Oh my, my god! god. Peter, who? What the hell is going on here? God knows. Do you know this woman, Mrs. Ashworth? I've never seen her before in all my life. Lol. <laughs> Seriously. Now she'll think we are absolutely crazy. I wouldn't worry too much. You're not exactly the most popular neighbour in the house, anyway. Thanks. What? You don't actually care what those idiots think, do you? No. Of course not. It's just that Pauline seems all right. I'm not too proud of causing her all this trouble. It'll get fixed soon. Look, Jesse's gone out. We can now get inside flat seven and see what he's been up to. Okay. We can also cross Pauline off the list. I've searched through her internet history. Yep, 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 okay. Let's just go back to the basement for a second. Can I open the paint with the scissors? Let's see, let's see. Oh! <laughs> Scissors would work, just stab it in. <sighs> Fine. What about this? Use a broom as a crank. No, okay.
Let's go look in that guy's flat. The one I'm guessing plays a lot of video games. Which is why you hear shouting and guns going off. Hey, my Mitzi symbol's gone. How do I get it to pick the lock? Oh, there it is. Now that he's gone, we can get inside. Yes, let's do that. I'll close my eyes and you pick that lock, Mitzi. Okay, but no peeking. I'd never. You've really hurt my feelings now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now close them. Job done. Jesus, are these... Relax, Mrs. A. They're just Halloween masks. Oh, good. That's good. Because I swear, if I see another bloody head... Oh, we needed one, right? Okay, let's hit the hockey one. Yeah, okay. Lol, okay. Use this extension cord thing. Okay, so now can I use it? So, who's got windows over this side of the building? Well, Joe Davis lives right below. I guess we could also check one flat below Joe's. I just hope the cable's long enough. Let's find out, shall we? Wait, that's not to fix the computer, that's to climb out? Okay. What? Oh, I meant to go down and plug it in? Okay. Just check the map. Okay. Or not. What do you mean? What's the point? I don't understand. Would you... I thought we meant to climb down or something. So, what next? If only there was a way to power up Jesse's PC. Did you really? Well, I plugged that in. What am I meant to do? Give me more hints. So, if only there was a way. Well, I plugged that in, and then they're like, oh, let's climb out.
Let's say the Davis flat, didn't they? Oh, I don't know. I went to the wrong one, didn't I? Okay, so now can she pick this lock can as well? Can you unlock this door for us? Let's see. Blimey, this is a very special lock. Great. I am. Why would anyone need one of these here? Is there any other way we can get inside then? Well, not unless we can find some plastic ex or a key. Yeah, because I'm sure. Well, what can I say? Let's try to think. What do you mean? I don't even know right now. Can you open this one? What do you mean? Just do it. Would you like to try your famous lock picking skills on this lock here? Let's. A young child could open this lock with a piece of wire. That's fantastic. Have you done it yet? No. I can't work when you're looking over my shoulder. Oh, just do, do it. Mind? Seriously, just do it. No, sure. I'll just. Thanks. Just get on with it. Right, okay. Let's take that, finally something I can use. 